what's good y'all it's your boy ross back at it again with another video so i got a chance to check out mortal kombat last night when it first dropped on hbo max and i must say i enjoyed it being a fan of the mortal kombat games i got everything for the most part that i really wanted out of this movie you get the blood you get the guts you get the gore you get the violence and you get the eccentric over the top martial art characters that you've grown to know and love over the years through the games do they have all the popular characters that you would want to see in the mortal kombat movie no but i do think this movie is a jump off to set up for the mortal kombat universe if they were to decide to go that route but i think this movie is a definite setup the way the plot plays out it's a definite setup for a sequel i don't want to go into too many spoilers i'll probably do a spoiler review later on this weekend so stay tuned to that just gonna kind of keep it vague but um honestly if they were to drop a sequel for this movie i would definitely be uh interested in seeing um i will say this when it comes to them living up to the adaptation of the games, I think they do a pretty good job. I, I feel like if you're the fan of the games like I am, you're going to love this movie. Like I would recommend anyone that plays Mortal Kombat and have played it in the past and they enjoy the series as a whole, go see this movie. <clears throat> to me, I think this is the best on-screen adaptation of Mortal Kombat we've ever had. Um... And I, I think they did a very good job. You can tell they actually cared about the source material and they wanted to please the hardcore fans. So if you're a fan of this movie, go see it. That's all I really need to say. Now, if you're, well, not a fan of the movie, if you're a fan of the series, go see the movie. Um, if you're new to the Mortal Kombat series, you know a little bit here and there, but not too much. I think you will enjoy it just, just as much. Well, let me rephrase that. I, won't, I wouldn't say just as much. You'll be kind of confused on why certain people will find each other in the dialogue and you know in the backstory but i think you just in, i think you will enjoy it in the sense of just the action the choreography the special effects i think you will enjoy it on that aspect of things um speaking of the choreography the first seven minutes of the actual movie like the end like the little prologue is just fantastic fantastic choreo it lets it gives you i want to say <clears throat> A dive into how this movie is gonna play out when it comes to the fighting it's it's brutal it's gory it's bloody but it is enjoyable and i do think they killed the choreography some of the acting was kind of spotty definitely a lot of the acting in certain spots were very cheesy kind of like how it is in the game so i kind of get get the game and the uh, movie dialogue kind of being one in the same but i do there are some standout performances and i will say i don't want to go into spoilers like i said i'll talk about it in my spoiler part spoiler review but i will say kano is the best part of this movie he is the he is the heart of this movie who the guy they casted as kano let me let me say his name josh lawson he perfectly embodied how kano would be in a live action setting of his character it is perfect bro spot on he like i said he's the best part of this movie he kind of he gives the movie that entertaining entertaining like value like the side where you're not seeing the fighting you're not seeing the, the cg you're not seeing the blood and guts when it's just like some downtime and just character development type stuff he's the best part only because the dude is he's spot on he is i don't think we you know those type of roles where you got hugh jackman is perfect as wolverine i don't you can't see yourself see anyone else playing wolverine uh other than hugh jackman or the same as in iron man you can't see no one else playing iron man other than robbie downey jr same here i cannot see anyone else playing kano other than josh lawson because he killed it he was fantastic and he kind of kept me in the movie when there were certain points of the movie where it was kind of dragging with the dialogue and the characters because a lot of these characters you don't really get a chance to get to know that well because the movie would be too long so you kind of just have to they kind of gloss over them for the most part but it was 
he was definitely that enjoyable factor that kept me, you know, engaged within the movie. Um, but other than that, movie was serviceable. Like I said, I, I, I can't really nitpick this in a sense because it's like it's Mortal Kombat. You're there to see the kills. You're there to see some blood, guts, gore, some fighting, and you're there to hear some flawless victory, fatality. Your soul is mine. Like you're there for that. That's all you're really there for. You're not really too much invested in the character developments. And that's why I also said, if you're a fan of the series, you're going to enjoy this movie. If you're not a fan of the series, you'll probably like it. But you're, there's going to be a lot of parts you're going to be confused on. You're not going to understand what's going on here. So it, it, it would behoove you to be, in, in a sense, a fan of the Mortal Kombat series to really enjoy it. Rather than someone that's just kind of new and fresh to it. And they just kind of lost like what's going on why is there a fire dragon what what's happening here why is there a guy with four arms someone explain to me but other than that movie was enjoyable man so comment down below let me know if you guys had a chance to see mortal kombat and if you guys enjoy the movie comment down below let me know who was your favorite character in this movie for me obviously it was kano he was fantastic hilarious funny and i loved his character within the movie no spoilers in the comment section please don't spoil anything wait till my spoiler video so you can comment some of the spoilers in that video like i said it will be dropping this weekend but i appreciate all the love and support road to 40k appreciate y'all kicking it with me i'll see y'all on the next one peace